Y'all ready to go shopping? <laughs> Since Aubrey's dream trip is out, I want to take her to get professional pictures done. Oh, it's nice in here. We're going shopping to find cute outfits so she can wear for our photo shoot. I was thinking maybe like a white dress. I don't really like the dress because she needs more color in it. Well, how about you decide? This one is cute. No. We're not gonna have Aubrey looking like a thot. <laughs> I don't know. Drea, oh <laughs> my God. Oh my gosh, we're never gonna agree on an outfit for Aubrey. I should have that fine to say though. She is my daughter. So you know my mom been living with me for a while now. Yeah. So I finally got to tell her that she needs to move out. Yeah. Why? I mean, you really your mom? Oh my God, like, I need my independence. Like, we've been living with each other for years. It's time for me to be on my own. Well, did she have somewhere else to play, to stay? Or did she really find a place? I'm gonna help her find something else. Well, damn, you really want your mom out. She needs to be on her own. It's time for me and my mom to both grow up and gain some independence. I want to focus on dating, and that's not easy with my mom hovering around over me all the time. Oh my God, this dress is so pretty. Right. You could probably fit us. Yup. <laughs> this is your wedding dress, girl. My wedding dress, girl. <laughs> Her wedding dress. Let's see. <gasps> Are you that serious? Is so pretty, Amanda. <laughs> Get that away from me. So how did it go with the anniversary? I haven't told anyone what happened at the two-year anniversary dinner with Jordan. I mean, I'm still embarrassed about the whole thing. So, like, he took me out to dinner. You know, we were just nice. And, you know, that's when he said he had something for me. Because, you know, at the moment, I felt like he was going to propose to me or something. Because right. he was, like, getting so serious. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. So then he comes out and he goes, babe, I got you a surprise. I was like, what? And he goes, I got you a saxophone player. What's wrong? So then I got all teary and stuff because like, I felt dumb because I thought it was gonna be something else. So then, you know, I got up, I started crying and I excused myself mm -hmm. and I walked off. But I just wanna go home. Do I look kind of crazy? Cause you know, I no. walked off. No, cause you thought you had your hopes high on a ring, so. Mm, yeah. I would have flipped the table over. I would have been like, where's my brain? <laughs> <laughs> you have to tell him. Just tell him how you feel. I don't know. If he asked you to marry you, would you marry him? Yeah. If I was sitting there waiting for a ring and a saxophone player showed up, I would took that sex and shoved up his ass. It's OK. Just tell him how you feel yeah. about the situation. I need a hug. Yes, I need a hug. Oh, is she with her? 